Hi guys, today we will see how to make software upgrade on the DUW digital unit for WCDMA. So to first see that uh, what we are uh, using current software, we will make one CV before software upgrade. This is good practice to have a backup CV. So if anything goes wrong, we can restore. So uh, just checking the things, uh, we run ALT command to see that there are some alarms for the password and uh, there is no synchronization. Plus there are some uplink and downlink baseband pool uh, capacity because DUWs are added and they are not being used. So once this is a situation that there is hardware available but it is not being used so we will have this alarm. Uh, coming back to this command CAB, it can show us the serial number, the temperature, and the core status of the of the active of the, this DUW. We can also see the product number of the DUW as well. So I need to show you my FTP setup. I am using Core FTP. Uh, it is pretty much easy to do the setup. Uh, my username and password is RBS, and my home directory is CBBU. This folder, and this is the folder. You can see that uh, I have uh, extracted the software. This is our .xml file which we will give the path of. So showing you the permissions and other things. Only this there is one small thing permissions and all the things on the right sh side should be checked. And uh, let's see this setting also. There is uh, this is IP of my laptop and port 21 and base directory is my home directory which I already showed to you so I will now generate uh, my uh, my path to so that uh, my uh, like this uh, this file can reach to my laptop so first command is LPR upgrade P this shows us what are the current uh, softwares on the node uh, I have two softwares on the node right now and I will be upgrade, upgrading the third one so let's see the same thing can be seen from the CVLS command also the third paragraph shows us that what softwares are being used here so uh, we need to create one MO uh, here I have uh, already prepared everything uh, I will paste these files to you uh, to the YouTube uh, description section so that uh, you can uh, use these uh, like commands and copy paste them in the notepad file to be used in the later on. So I am generating one R27 BA03 MO. I will give my laptop IP 169.254.1.2 which is my laptop's IP and I will give the path of the folder where this file is located username will be rbs and password will be rbs as well because these are the username and passwords for the ftp so here we see we just saw that there was my uh, laptop being logged in by the duw and this mo is generated uh, once i put ltr and and show this upgrade p and now i can see there is another new new line r27 b03 which was which was not there before so my ne next command will be checking the mo's acl 1477 1472 and it will give me all the options and I will use non-blocking force install for the uh, for running this uh, performing the action on this MO POLU is the command to see the uh, to see the status of uh, the upgrade install how it is going there are two steps uh, of the software upgrade on the DUW first it is being installed so once installation is finished then it upgrades uh, right now this is our first step where we are installing the file once we are finished the, with the install we will uh, do next step to make the upgrade here we are uh, I will keep pausing so that uh, my video can be of shorter length otherwise it takes much time and the uh, video will be too long so I will keep pausing so that uh, it quickly finishes. Uh, and when you guys will do it it will take long time for you but in my laptop because I am pausing the video so that lot of steps are performed in one action okay we we are now uh, finished with the install uh, our next procedure will be to check the upgrade P uh, put one uh, LT space all and now we are ready to have our next uh, procedure next procedure is 
to upgrade the uh, this same software which we just installed uh, procedure is uh, commands are somewhat similar i will show you first uh, we will put acl and go to the code specific proxy number 1472 and acc space 1472 space reboot node upgrade and yes and again it will uh, we will need to see what upgrade status is so we will run the command polu and it will show us whatever is going on on this uh, mo what actions are being performed by polling we can see this i will once again make pass so that uh, the time of the video is shorter and but once you guys will do it you will see all the steps and it will take much more time in your laptop than it has taken in my laptop I will share these files later on in the description section of the YouTube. Okay, it is not opening. I will use shortcut. Okay guys we have reached up to 6% and we can see there are some steps going on uh, verify LM files and uh, enter upgrade every time uh, like we are running some commands there are some steps some pre checks by the node itself on the software before it uh, take it into operation because if the if the software is not okay for the node it will crash later on and making an outage for us so node has an automatic system to check the status of the upgrade before making an actual upgrade so we are here seeing now that uh, our 80-90% process is done and node has restarted on a different CV we can see this all the all the upgrade, uh, progress header is showing that what steps are already done and here it is showing that uh, we we are uh, we have booted up on another new CV previous software was R22AB and the new software is R27BA upgrade is still executing just it is uh, like taking some time to check that whether node is up up or down and now uh, I pause the video so that we can see the result now we have found that upgrade is completed and we will go to LPR command and see that what is actually done at the site CVLS is the command it shows us that uh, uh, there is another third software in the in the third paragraph you can see there is another third software uh, good procedure is this that uh, we make a backup CV after the upgrade and other things uh, this is the CV which is right now loaded R27 BA03 and upgrade is completed so uh, this is the last CV which is right now was created in the last uh, update so we will make one CV after the procedure so that uh, node does not revert back to the old old software this simple command will uh, key well will uh, keep the node from reverting back to the old software and that's it for this video uh, this video was just to just to see that how a software upgrade on the DUW can be done we have seen this uh, similar procedure for the base band but this procedure was for DUW so this is it see you guys next time thank you for watching